Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Adriana. Good evening, Angela. Good evening, everybody. So, how's everything? How are you? It's a good. Fine. Okay. Thank you. And you? Oh, nice. I'm very well. Thank you for asking. It's good to see you one more day. Es bueno verles un día más. Good to see you one more day. Me, me too, oh, teacher. Me too, teacher. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Just let me check something here. Muchas gracias por la plataforma, por la tarea. Ya completé. O yeah. sea, solo eso me faltaba. Yeah, it's okay. No problem. Uh, I thank asked. You. The thing is that somebody asked me the last time. Ali, alguien me preguntó la vez pasada. Y había quedado pendiente de, de hacer la, la consulta. Ah, pero sí. ahora consulté porque se repitió mucho el, el problema. Y gracias, sí, a Dios que... Que... Ajá. y gracias a Dios que lograron solventar. Uh -huh. Cuando vi que mis compañeras tenían como la misma Good problemática. Good evening. Good evening. Sentí como alivio. ¿vale? Dije, ah, pues no, entonces no, no es como algo en común, algo yes. general. Yes, so you said he's uh -huh. not my problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was not your okay. Yeah, it was the, the problem was with the platform, okay? Uh, yes. maybe with the setting, así como estaba configurado el ejercicio, seguramente había un error, pero ahora lo revisaron y lo solventaron. They they checked and they and they fixed the problem. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, los demás ya lo hicieron. Estaba revisando la plataforma y algunos que no lo han corregido todavía el el de switch off the activity on the platform. I fix it. Ah, you fix it. Okay, very good. Yes. Los demás también ya arreglaron el problema. You fix the problem. Con el switch off. Yes, teacher. Yes. yes. Okay, that's excellent. Very good. And you, Adriana? The, the microphone. Yes, teacher. Finish. Okay, perfect. Okay. Darwin? Finish and uh, correct the... Uh, the sentence. Okay, you corrected the sentence. Yeah, switch means? off. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. Good. Thank you. Nice. Okay. Your excellent. Your yeah, it's okay. It's my pleasure. Okay. So I hope everyone fixed the problem. Okay. Espero que todos hayan solucionado el problema con el switch off. Okay. That was a pain yeah. in the head, in the neck. Okay. That was like, do you know what is a pain in the neck? A pain in the neck. It's an idiom. It's un, una frase idiomática. It's an idiomatic phrase. It was a pain in the neck. Do you know what that is? ¿Saben qué es? No, teacher. It was a pain in the neck. Fue un dolor en el, en el cuello, sería, ¿verdad? Literalmente, but... ¿qué, qué, qué, ¿Qué traducción le podríamos dar? It was a pain in the neck. Well... Un inconveniente, un problema, no sé. Ajá, uh -huh. there was a problem, ¿ok? It was a problem. Como que estuvimos batallando y no podíamos arreglarlo. So it was like a big problem. Yeah. So it was a pain in the neck. Okay. <laughs> It's yeah, an idiot. It was a serious problem, by the way. Because you got 96. Porque todos quedaban con 96. No les daba el 100%. You didn't get 100%, right? But now you do, pero ahora sí ya lo lograste. Yo dije, well, you, you did it. Sorry? Yo dije, vamos a, vamos a tener mal récord. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and I was like, and I was feeling bad about that. So that's why I, feel, I try to, to contact Inglés Corporativo to fix the, the problem, okay? Yes. I don't Thank know. You. I don't know why I felt guilty. Me sentía como culpable. I felt a little guilty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But the most important is that the problem uh, was fixed. Okay. That's the most important. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, just to inform you, ahora vamos, eh, vamos a terminar la clase a las 10 y 16. Y la persona que tiene la sesión privada. Eh, va de las 10 y 16 a las 10 y 26, ¿ok? ¿Ya? Yeah. Ah, les explico rápidamente por qué. Que creo que fue antier, si no mal recuerdo. Este antier a mí se me cortó el internet y ustedes estaban trabajando en equipo y me sacó 
y volví a entrar. Entonces, eh, ya no me grabó la sesión y debe estar grabada para como, re, como, como registro para Insafor. Así que, I'm sorry about that. Y no grabó, entonces hay que recuperar ese tiempo. So, we have to recover that time. But it's only 16 minutes. Solo son 16 minutos nada más, ¿ok? So, 10, okay, 10 16, teacher. we finish, ¿ok? Así que, la, yes, that's right. So, we have more, more practice and more activities. Uh -huh. Así yes. que terminamos a las 10 y 16 para que después algunos me digan, teacher is time, teacher is time, ok, para que no me van a estar diciendo teacher is time, ok. Yes. Ok, perfect. Solo va a ser este día, it's only today, ok. No va a ser todos los días, ok, so don't worry. Yo sé que están cansaditos todos, llegan de su trabajo muy cansados, eh, pero solo va a ser hoy nada más, it's only today, ok. So it's, uh, it's worth the effort, ok. Good, so let me pass okay. the attendance quickly then. Voy a pasarles asistencia rápidamente. So, Ada Patricia. Present. Adriana. Present. Ana Michelle. Ángela. Present, teacher. Azalia Melanie. Darwin. Present, teacher. Very good. Flor. Present, teacher. Ray, Gloria. Uh, here. Okay, good. Carla. Presentation. Excellent. Margarita. Maria. Presentation. Maya. Margarita. Margarita present. Okay. Maria. Presentation. Okay. Mayra. Nelson. Ofelia. Ok, excelente. Eh, ya, yeah. Osmin. Present teacher. Rafael. Present. Rosa. Sandra. Chansi. Present teacher. Zulma. Present. And Miguel. Present teacher. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay, everybody. So uh, welcome to this last day of the week. Okay, bienvenidos a este último día de la semana. Welcome to this last day of the week. Um, today we finish unit number three, right? So do you remember uh, the name of unit number three? What is the name of unit number three? Troubleshoot. Troubleshooting, right? Troubleshooting. <laughs> Troubleshooting. Okay. Troubleshooting. Very good. Um, well, basically, in Unit 3, uh, we studied uh, different things, right? And very, very important things. For example, we studied the present perfect, okay? Like, I have checked uh, the printer, I have checked the scanner, or I have checked the email, all right, I have checked, okay? So if I say, for example, I have checked my email, how do you say this in Spanish? I have checked my email. How do you say this in Spanish? Yo tengo que chequear mi email. Tengo que revisar mi email. He revisado mi email. Okay, thank you, Adriana. Okay, remember, it's present perfect. Aquí el verbo have, it has, no tiene el significado de tener, sino el de haber. I have checked. I have checked. Don't forget. Okay, que no se les olvide. Don't forget, please. So you can say, I have checked my email. Uh, now imagine I say, I have visited some clients. How do you say this in Spanish? Yo he visitado he visitado clientes. clientes. Ah, yo he visitado algunos clientes, okay? I have visited some clients, okay? Good. Another example. Um, I have learned, I have learned English. He enseñado inglés? No, learned, no. learned. He I aprendido. Have, he aprendido. He aprendido. He aprendido inglés. I have learned English, English okay? Uh, and how do you make the negative? ¿Cómo hacemos el negativo? Do you remember? I don't. 
No, no, no. I have not. I have, I not. have not. I have not or I, I have. have not. Okay. I, I have not, not or not I have. Yes. Have For not. example, I have not visited my clients. Yo no he visitado mis clientes. Or mm -hmm. I have not I checked not. the printer. I have not checked the printer. No he chequeado or revisado. La impresora, okay, the printer, the impresora, okay, very good, that's excellent. So don't forget this, please, que no se les olvide, don't forget, present, perfect, okay? Yeah, have or has. For example, I can say, um, let me see here, I can say, Sandra, Sandra hasn't connected to the class yet. Sandra hasn't connected to the class yet. Sandra no se ha conectado ah, a la clase exactly. todavía. Sandra no se ha conectado a la clase todavía. Sandra has not connected to the class yet. Okay, good. So, or I can say, for example, let me see a boy here. <laughs> Nelson, okay. Nelson, yes. ha Nelson has not connected to the class. Nelson has not connected to the class. Oh, Sandra is connected. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, yes. <laughs> these, these are only examples, Sandra, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Sa I'm sorry, Sandra. I didn't see you were connected, okay? Good. So, uh, basically, present perfect is have or has, and then we have a verb in past participle, okay? Regular verbs are easy because we only put ED, checked, with ED, visited with ED, but irregular verbs change, okay? Los irregulares cambian. Mm -hmm. For example, I have eaten two hamburgers. I have eaten two hamburgers. How do you say this in Spanish? I comido una hamburguesa. Me, me he comido, me he me comido, he comido, comido. Uh, me he comido dos hamburguesas, okay? Uh -huh. or, may, or maybe you can say, I have drunk, I have drunk three cups of coffee. Mm. Me he tomado tres tazas de café. Ah, me he tomado tres tazas de café. Me, listen to the, to, to the examples in Spanish. Me he tomado. A mm. ver, right? So have is a ver or has. Okay, mm -hmm. let's see. Adriana, do you drink coffee? Yes. ¿Cuántas tazas te has tomado hoy? How many cups? Three. Three cups, um, okay. Just uh -huh. like this. The, uh -huh. Breakfast and the refri. Uh, no. Snack, no. snack, snack, uh -huh. Uh -huh. And, and now, and now, uh -huh. all right, so, so in the uh -huh. example, I can say Adriana has, because for he, she, I say has, right, Adriana has drunk three cups of coffee today, Adriana se ha tomado tres tazas de café hoy, she has drunk three cups of coffee today, okay, This is just to remember, just to refresh. Es solo para reflejar un poquito y recordar que no se les olvide este tema, ¿ok? Porque Thank si you. yo no les recuerdo, ya no lo repasan ustedes, ya lo vi. <laughs> ¿Ok? English is practice. El inglés es pura práctica. English is practice, ¿ok? Entienden el tema del momento, pero si ya no lo vuelven a revisar, se les olvida. Y después ya no pueden usar la estructura. Así que dejar de mantenerse como repasando, ¿ok? So keep checking, please. Yeah? And practicing, ¿ok? Which is important. Good. Now, in yesterday, yesterday, um, you studied some phrasal verbs, right? Estudiaron algunos verbos con frases, some phrasal verbs, or verbs with prepositions, okay? Yes. Which verbs do you remember? ¿Cuáles verbos recuerdan? Which verbs do you remember? I understand, Nelson, don't worry. Nelson, I understand, don't worry. Pull up. Ah, we yeah. started collab. 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 Yes, collab. Switch up. Switch off. Switch off. Yes, like switch off the light. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Sorry, Osmin. Adapt. Adapt. Sorry, repeat it. Adapt. 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 But the ones we. ADD. You. Yes, these are the ones. Um, I think it was Hola. Nelson who shared. ¿Quién fue que compartió Nelson, right? Que compartió una lista. Oh, yeah. Yes, okay. Yeah, this is on the list Nelson shared, okay? 
El que, está, el que nos está diciendo dos mil está en la lista que nos compartió Nelson. Okay, he's on the list, okay? Yes, okay, very good. Okay, thank you. I can see you are studying. Very good. So, but from yesterday, de los de ayer, from the ones we studied Cisab. yesterday. Cizap. Colab. What is Cizap? Atascarse. Atascarse, okay, trabarse, atascarse. Good. So, um, clean, up. clean up. Clean up, yeah, clean up. It's like clean the, the clean house. Up. Clean yeah. up. Only that. Clean up. Sorry? Painting up. Painting. Tinten up. Tinten up. Tinten up. Ah, tighten. Okay, tighten up. Tighten up. Like tighten, tighten up, okay? Tighten up a screw or a bolt, okay? Tighten up. Apretar, right? Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Seize up. Okay, very good. So yesterday we studied different phrasal verbs and Nelson shared a big list of phrasal verbs, okay? So study them. Estos son muy importantes. These are common and important phrasal verbs, okay? So study them. Tomen tiempo de vez en cuando y estudien los. Study them, okay? They are very important in English, okay? <laughs> very good. Now, uh, well, thank you for sharing. Now let's go to today's class. So listen, uh, in today's class, we have, let me, let me share with you. We have many activities, okay? But the first activity we have for today, Oh, hold on a second. Yeah. Hold on a second. We have a reading, okay? And this reading contains some tips on how to organize a preventing maintenance plan, okay? Maintenance plan, okay? For machines or for different equipment, right? Yeah? Good. And we have the article here. Good. So listen, this article is on page number 37, okay? Page number 37. The first, the first activity we are going to do is pronunciation, okay? Pronunciation. So listen to the pronunciation and follow the reading. Escuchen la pronunciación y sigan la lectura, okay? Listen and follow the reading, okay? Are you ready? Okay. ¿Estamos listos? Yes, yes. yes. So, so stay focused, please. Quédense enfocados. Stay focused, okay? <clears throat> Okay, let's start. Empecemos. Let's start. Hold on a second. Give me a second. Okay, let's start with step number one. Step number one. Get the right people on board before you begin to organize your preventing maintenance plan. You need to have the right people on board with the plan. Include top management, maintenance managers, maintenance technicians, and any other staff who understands the way your system operates. This could include people from data processing, accounting, craftsmen, and members of production and production control. You may not need input from each of these people at every step of the process, but it's important to have them on board and kept up to date so you can get important feedback as you go. Step two, set goals for your preventive maintenance plan. Using your task forces input, set goals you hope to achieve using the system. Begin training your task force on the computer skills they'll need when your preventive maintenance plan goes into full effect. Okay, let's go to the next. The next one is step number three, right? Step number three, inventory the equipment and assets. Go through your facility and inventory all the equipment you're considering, including in your preventing maintenance plan, tagging the equipment as you go. Create a list of all the, the assets you have responsibility for. Record the following details as you go and keep in mind that this process is much easier to carry out and organize with the assistance of a good preventive maintenance software program. Okay, listen again. Escuchamos otra vez. Listen again. Step one. Get the right people on board before you begin 
to organize your preventive maintenance plan, you need to have the right people on board with the plan. Include top management, maintenance managers, maintenance technicians, and any other staff who understands the way your system operates. This could include people from data processing, accounting, craftsmen, and members of production and production control. You may not need input from each of these people at, at every step of the process, but it's important to have them on board and kept up to date so you can get important feedback as you go. Step number two, set goals for your preventive maintenance plan. Using your task forces input, set goals you hope to achieve using the system. Begin training your task, your task force on the computer skills they'll need when your preventive maintenance plan goes into full effect. Step three, inventory the equipment and assets. Go through your facility and inventory all the equipment you're considering including, including in your preventive maintenance plan. Tagging the equipment as you go. Create a list of all the assets you have responsibility for. Record the following details as you go. And keep in mind that this process is much easier to carry out and organize with the assistance of a good preventive maintenance software program. Very good. Now I ask you, what words are difficult for you to pronounce? So is, this is the moment. So tell me, what vocabulary? Crassling? So, Which one? In which line? Uh, step, step one. Oh, okay, yes. okay, I got it. Okay. What else? <laughs> Thank you very much. Maintenance, maintenance, maintenance. Okay. okay, maintenance. Very good. Maintenance, maintenance. Maintenance, what else? <laughs> Mash, man, 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 management. 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 In which step? In which step is it? Management. Daily. Oh, daily, top daily. management. Top management. Top management. Daily. Sorry. Daily. Daily need. Daily need. In which step? Mm, Are they all need? Step. step here, right? Ah, yes. Yes. They all need. All right. They all need. What else? Go through. Go through. All right. Achieve. Go, go to achieve. Achieve. Uh -huh. achieve. 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 Okay. Okay. Achieve is like lograr, right? Sorry. Taking. Mm. Taking. In which line? In which step? Step three. Step three. What is the word? Like Let me see, I don't see it. Take in the equipment. The equipment. Inventory of the equipment. Oh, tagging, tagging. Tag, yes, tagging. Tagging. tagging the equipment. Tagging the equipment. Okay, what else? Include, right? It's here to carry. To carry out. It's here, it's here to carry. And stamp three. Mm. Easier to carry out and to carry. Uh -huh. yes. Only that? Yes, yes, yes. Only that. Okay, very good. So uh, please turn off the microphones and let's pronounce together. Okay, apaguen el micrófono y vamos a pronunciar cada una de ellas tres veces, okay? Are you ready? So we go in order. Vamos a ir en orden. We go in order, okay? Are you ready? Okay, let's do it. Maintenance. 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 
Maintenance. Maintenance. Maintenance. Management. 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 Include. 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 Men. Craftsman. 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 Achieve. 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 They'll need. They'll need. They'll need. Go through. Go through. Go through. Go through. Tagging the equipment. Tagging the equipment. Details. 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 Here you can say details too, right? Details and details are okay. Okay, the two pronunciations are correct. Okay, details or details. Okay, so let's continue. Easier to carry out. <clears throat> Easier to carry out. Easier to carry out. Okay, so as I said, uh, this reading uh, or this article, it's on page number. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, so this reading is on page number 37, okay? Page number 37. Okay, very good. Now listen, uh, the idea in this moment is that you go and practice together. Practice the pronunciation of the article together, okay? In pairs. Don't say I finished, please. No digan ya terminé. Just continue, 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 practice, practice, and practice, okay? I will give you like, seven or 10 minutes, okay? So the seven or 10 minutes, don't stop. No dejen de practicar, don't stop practicing, okay? If I visit a group and I see you are like talking about a different topic and you're not practicing, I will tell you, okay? So please, these seven or 10 minutes are to practice, to pronounce, okay? To practice your pronunciation. If you finish, do it again, 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 again and over again, all right? So don't stop practicing, no dejen de practicar. Take turns, tomen turnos, okay? Take turns with your uh, pair, okay? Any question? No. Any question? Okay. No, everything, Thank okay. You. All right, okay. Okay, let's go to practice. Anyway, ah, anyway, uh -huh. anyway, anyway, the uh, the class uh, is 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 much large. Yes, <laughs> teacher. Hello. The, the class long. is going to be long. long. Yes, I'm long. sorry. It will be longer. It will be longer than than normal. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. What a surprise, teacher, because I, in my plan today, I, I will go into uh, sleep uh, late, early. Oh, I'm <laughs> early sorry. In my plan. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm sorry. It's only 16 minutes, okay? So, oh, oh, ahora toca la sesión uno a uno. No. no. No, it's, no, it's only 16 minutes. Será bien preciso con el tiempo. Son solo 16 minutos. Okay? Yo, yo, yo pensé que no se cortaba, teacher. El, el, cuando, cuando usted se sale. Lastimosamente, 
Y yo, el detalle es que yo retomé la sesión, ¿ok? Porque yo inmediatamente, como a los dos minutos, me volví a conectar. Pero la segunda vez que me conecté no me grabó y yo no me di cuenta tampoco. Ah. <ríe> Ese fue el problema. That was the problem, ¿ok? Pero la clase se dio, o sea, I keep the class. So, sí, sí. Since he was a, mí ha, a mí me ha pasado, pero, pero no, no. O sea, que digamos por problemas de internet me he, tenido, me he salido, que yo he puesto a grabar la clase. Y cuando, o sea, me, pero alguien siempre se queda grabando. Cuando yo regreso, siempre está. A mí, o sea, me, ha no sale. Yes. A mí me ha pasado dos veces eso. Y se sé con time, ¿ok? Y el problema okay. es que como uno está confiado que está grabando, ok, so mm. you're not paying attention. Ajá. El problema fue cuando ya terminé la sesión 1 a 1, como a las 10 y 14. Veo y no estaba grabando y was not recording. I forgot. Se me olvidó totalmente. I forgot totally. <laughs> <laughs> okay, teacher. Okay, all right, continue. Thank you. Carla, okay. eh, you are step one, I, I, I read step two, you are step three. Okay. And next, other, uh, uh, okay. you and okay. me, you and me, okay? Step okay. Today, so, can get import, feedback, and you go. Finish, uh, number, no, step uh, number one. Step two. Yes. Okay. Step two. Step goa for you preventive maintenance plan. Using your task force input says goal to how to achieve using the system. Begin training your task force on the computer skill. They daily need when your preventive maintenance, maintenance plan goes into full effect. Okay, step number three, then the equipment and test. Go through your facility and inventory, the equipment, your catering, including in your preventive maintenance plan, taking the equipment as you go, create a list of all the tests you have responsibility for. Record the following details as you go and keep in mind that this process is much easier to carry up and organ organize with the assistance of a good preventive maintenance 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 software program okay Thanks. Uh, start step one you i Get the right people of Boa. Before you, before you begin to organize your preventive maintenance plan, you need to have the right people on board with the plan. Include two manager, maintenance manager, maintenance technicians, and any other staff who understand the way. You sister operate. The, the school include people from data processing accounting, craftsmen, and members of products and products control. You may not, not need input from age of these people at every step on the process, but it is important to have then of board and kept and kept today so you can get important feedback as you go. Continue. Step number two. Step goes for the prevent to understand. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, understand. The way. The way. The way your system operates. This call include people from that 
processing, accounting, craftsmen, and members of production and production, production control. Control. Okay. You you many not uh, need input from each of uh, these people at every step of the process, but it's important to have them involved and keep and clear up today so you can get input feedback, feedback as you go. Okay, step number two. Set goal for your preventive maintenance plan. plan. Using your task force input, set goals you hope to to uh, achieve. 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 To achieve using the system the system begin training your task force on the computer skill they need when you preventing maintenance maintenance play, maintenance 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 maintenance, maintenance. playing goes into full effect effect Effect. Okay. Effect. Okay. Step three. Maintain. Maintain. Inventory. The right equipment and asset. Go through your facility and inventory all the equipment you 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 are considering in cloud in your preventive mind might mind might maintenance 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 okay. maintenance maintenance plane tag and tagging tag tag tagging tag tagging tag tagging 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 that captain as you go Create a, a, a list a list of the the assets you have responsibility for. Record the following. Record the following uh, details as you go, and keep in mind that this process in much is easier to carry out and organize it with the assistance of a good preventive mine, maintenance for maintenance software program. Program, okay, very good. You can do it again if you want. So, sorry, Flor. <laughs> no, no, I in the start the number one. Set goal for your preventive maintenance plan using your task force input. Set goals you have to achieve using the system. Begin training your task force on the computer skill they all need when your preventive maintenance plan goes into full effect. Step three inventory the equipment and assets. Go through your facility and inventory all the equipment you're considering, considering in client in your preventing maintenance plan. Tagging the equipment as you go. Create a list of all the assets you have responsibility for. Record the following details as you go and keep in mind that this process is much easier to carry out your task force from the computer. 
skills need when you're preventing maintenance plan goes into full effort. Stage three, inventory the equipment and access. Go through your facility and inventory of the equipment you're considering, including in your preventing maintenance plan. Tag in the equipment as you go, try priority at least of all the assets to have responsibility for. Record the following details as you go and keeping in mind that this process is much easier to carry out and organize with the assistance, assistance of the- Assistance. 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 Assistant of a good preventing maintenance software program. <laughs> maintenance. 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 Yeah. Exactly. Maintenance, maintenance. Yeah. Maintenance, maintenance, maintenance. <laughs> Me trabé. <laughs> um, eh, Darwin, next. Any questions? Yeah. How, how, do, how do you say feedback in español? Retroalimentación. Feedback. Ah, Tenía lógica, ¿verdad? ¿Qué le dije yo? Alimentación, solo eso le salía. Retro. Retroalimentación sobre la... Ah, ajá. Yes, that's feedback. Retroalimentación sobre la march, marcha, dice, no sé. Uh -huh. Ok. Step one. Get the right people on board. Before you begin to organize your preventive maintenance plan. You need to have the right people on board with the plan. Include top management, maintenance managers, maintenance technicians, and any other staff who understand the way your system operates. The school includes people from data processing, accounting, craftsmen, and members of production and production controllers. Control. You, you may not need input from each of these people at every stage of the process, but it's important to have them on board and and set up days so you can get important feedback as you go. Stay, stay to one. Set goal for your preventing maintenance. Maintenance plan. Using your stay force input. Set goal to help to achieve using the system. Begin training your task force on the computer skill days need when your preventing maintenance plan goes into full effect. Yes. Except three. Inventory the equipment and assets. Go through your facility and inventory of the equipment you're considering including in your preventive maintenance plan. Taking the equipment as you go, create a list of all the assets. You have responsibility for record the following details.
Okay, everyone. So uh, I guess everybody uh, took the time to pronounce a lot, right? So I'm sure uh, your pronunciation about the article is really good in this moment, okay? So let me listen to you, okay? So uh, let's see. Uh, we start with Adriana, okay? Adriana, uh, let me share, okay? Let me share. Okay. Adriana, you will read step one, okay? Okay. Rosa, step number two. And Miguel, step number three, okay? Adriana number one, Rosa number two, and Miguel number three. Okay, ready? Okay. Yes. Okay, let, let me let me share screens so you see the the reading. Okay, Adriana, you start. It's your turn. Okay. Step number one: get the right people on board. Before you begin to organize your preventive maintenance plan, you need to have the right people on board with the plan, include the management, maintenance managers maintenance technician and any other staff who understand the way your system operates. This could include people from that processing, accounting, craftsmen and members of production and production control. You may not need input from each of these people at every step of the process, but it's important to have them on board and get up to date so you can get important feedback as you go. Ay, puse nerviosa, teacher. It's okay, no problem. Continue, please. Who's next? <laughs> Who is next? Me, okay, me. continue. <laughs> Step two, <laughs> set goals for your preventing maintenance plan. Using your task force input, set goals you hope to achieve using the system. Begin training your task force on the computer skills. They'll need when your preventive maintenance plan goes into full effect. Next. Step three, inventory the equipment and assets. Go through your facility, your facility and inventory, all the equipment you are considering include in your preventive maintenance. Uh, plan. Maintenance plan. Tacting the equipment has your has has your has you go. <clears throat> Create a list of all assets you have responsibility for. Yeah, sure. <clears throat> Step four. Uh, four, record the following details as you go and keep out in the and keep on uh, and keeping in the mind that is that this process is much easier to carry out and organize it with the system of God preventive maintenance software program. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, thank you very one. Thank you everyone for your participation. Sorry, uh, let me see here. I have underlined some words. Okay. Uh, where you had some problems, maybe, okay? Good. Okay. Uh, record in here, uh, organize, okay? Now, uh, this first uh, word, for, this is for everybody, okay? Not only for the people who pronounce, okay? The number one is organize, organize, okay? Organize, data processing, data processing, or you can say data, data or data, okay? Data processing or data processing, control. Oh, data. Data or data, okay, no problem. Data or data, okay. data processing, okay? okay? Yeah, uh, control, you, you don't say control, you say control, control in this case, okay? Uh, maintenance, uh, maintenance, maintenance, this, this word has been really problematic, right? Okay, maintenance, okay? Uh, including? Maintenance. Maintenance, yeah, including tagging, okay, tagging is not, Tagging is tagging the equipment, okay? Tagging the equipment. Record, to this and record, están diciendo otra cosa, record, un record, okay? And in this case, record is like grabar, okay? It's different. Record, say record, record. And finally, organize, okay? Organize, very good. Now, I will stop sharing here. Thank you very much, okay? Uh, now, listen, um, the same with the article, we have another activity, okay? In this activity, the, acti the name of this activity is called What's Next? What's Next? Or 
¿Qué es lo que sigue? What's next? Ok, listen. What's next? What's, what's next? For this activity, you need to be really focused. Deben estar bien enfocados en la lectura. You need to be really focused and scanning. Scanning the information. Scanning the information like scanning. Ok, listen. I will mention a phrase. I will mention a phrase or a word from the reading. Ok, voy a mencionar una frase o una palabra de la lectura. The idea is that you tell me what's next. Que ustedes me digan lo que sigue a esa palabra o a esa frase, ¿ok? Yeah. Okay. From the reading. Sí, but sí, but sí, for sí. this, for this, ¿ok? You need to raise your hand, ¿ok? The first participant to raise the hand will have the chance. El primero que levante la mano tendrá la oportunidad, ¿ok? Yeah. A mí me aparecen en orden cuando levantan la mano, ¿ok? So do you have the reading there? Tienen la, ahí su lectura. I won't show it, yes. okay? Yes, Esta vez no se la voy a poner. Yes, teacher. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Okay, yes. Okay, let's, let's do one example. Hagamos un ejemplo. Let's do one example. Before yes. you begin. To organize. Okay, Adriana. To organize. To organize. To organize. To organize. To organize. To organize. Very good. So this to is organize. the idea, okay? Please. So please, don't give Como quito answer. la manita, teacher. Ahí mismo aparece el lower hand en la misma Ahí opción. mismo. Ah, bajar la mano. Ya, dice ya, lower ya. hand. Cuando ponen raise yes. hand, la sube y se van ahí mismo y dice lower hand Ajá. o bajar la mano. ¿Ok? ¿Lo tiene en español no, o en sí. inglés el menú? En español. Ok, mm. ahí mismo subir la mano o bajar la mano. Ok, y the, the same. Ok, okay very good. <laughs> I have it in English. Ok, very good. So, are you ready? Yes, yes, yes. Ok, let's see who scores more points. Vamos a ver quién es el que hace más puntos. Quién es el que lee más acá. Llevo una teacher. No, it was, it was an example. Ah, ah, era el example. Ah, yes, ah. it was the example. Okay. Ready? Okay. <laughs> yes, yes. It's important. <laughs> It's important. <laughs> ok, Azalia Melan. To have. To have them. On board yes. and oh, okay, okay. today. Yes. It's okay. That's enough. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Melanie. Yeah, it's correct. Okay. So Melanie has a point. Melanie is leading the activity. Okay. Melanie has one point in this moment. Let's continue. Okay. Maintenance technicians. Maintenance technicians. Any other staff who oh, understand? Wait, wait, Adriana? And <laughs> Adri any other staff who understand? All right, very good. So Adriana has a point, okay? Please hold on, okay? I will mention your name. Okay, si levantan la mano primero, me aparecen de primero. So I will mention your name so you can say what's next, okay? Okay, so Adriana and Melanie are, um, are on top in this moment, okay? Next. Uh-huh, let me see. Computer skills they'll need. Jansi. Jansi? When you preventing maintenance. Okay, maintenance okay. Plane. Okay, it's okay. Okay, Jansi, okay, Jansi has the point. Okay. Maria, you need to lower your hand. Maria necesita bajar la mano. Quedó levantada de la vez anterior. You need to lower your hand. Ahí mismo. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, let's continue. Mm -hmm. And members of production, and members of production, Janzi? And production control. And production control, okay. Oh my God, Janzi is scoring two points right now. Hey, what happened with the others? Come on. Teacher, yeah. ¿se puede seguir o, o ya no? Yes, of course. Yes. You can... Yeah, you can guess again. Porque yo ya la tenía, pero yo, yo vi que dijo usted, moment, moment. No, 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 it's okay. You can do it again if you want. The idea is that you score as many points as you can, okay? All right, let's carry on. Let's continue. Mm -hmm. You may not need input. You may not need input, Angela. Uh, from each day of these people. Mm -hmm. From each of these people. Okay, that's really good. Okay, Angela has the point right now. Okay, very good. That's excellent. Let's carry on. This could include, 
This could include... Meeting okay. people from that processing. People from data processing, data. Okay, thank you, Adriana. People data. from data processing, data processing. Okay. Let's continue. And keep in mind, and keep in mind, all right, Angela, oh my God. That this process in March is a query. Out. All right, that's excellent, very good. Okay, let's see, Angela has two points right now. So we have a draw. Tenemos un empate aquí. Adriana, Jancy, and Angela. They, they, okay. They, there is a tie or a draw. <laughs> Very good. The, the, the situation is really tied. Okay. Let's carry on. Create a list of all the assets. You have Jancy. responsibility for. Uh, Jancy, raise hands first. Okay. So I'm you sorry. Have I'm sorry. Responsibility for. You have responsibility for. Okay. Thank you, Jancy. Thank you very much. Oh my God, and the others? Come on, only yeah. Melanie, Adriana, Jansky, and Angela, and Maria raise their hand too, okay? Okay, <laughs> get focused and focus and get focused. <laughs> All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, an easy one, una bien fácil. Go through your facility, go through your facility. And inventory all the equipment. <laughs> equipment. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's okay. Inventory, your flash. Yes, it's okay. Adriana, <laughs> raise hands. No, okay, Adriana. Adriana. <laughs> yes, Adriana. Adriana was first. Adriana was first. Adriana fue la primera. Yeah, Adriana was first. Okay, Adriana, you have three points, all right? Okay, cuando llevan cinco puntos, vamos a dar espacio a alguien más. We give space to somebody else, okay? Let's carry on. Tagging the equipment. Tagging the equipment. Angela. No, no. No, okay, okay. Uh, somebody else? Okay, Jancy. Ah, uh, yes, teacher. The microphone, Jancy. As you go. All right. Thank yes. you, Jancy. Thank you. Let's carry on. Sigamos. Let's carry on. Lower your hand. Jancy, lower your hand, please. Thank you. I give up, teacher. Record. <laughs> no, please don't. Please don't. Record the following details as you go. All right, let's see. Uh, and keep, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. And All right. keep in mind that this process. Okay, very good. Excellent, Sulma. Oh, we have another one. Very good. Software. 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 Floor. Program. Program. Okay, that's excellent. All right. That, that was easy. Next. <laughs> inventory the equipment and inventory the equipment and Jansi and assets okay Jansi you're out Jansi ya no puede participar ahorita you have five okay so Jansi please you can you can <laughs> raise your hand again all right let's continue with the others Mm, let me see. And any other staff? And any other staff? Angela? Who understands uh, who understand the, the okay. way? Who understands? Okay, good. Praise. So Dar Darwin was really close this time. Darwin estuvo cerca. Okay, Darwin was really close. <laughs> Do it faster, Darwin. Do it faster. Más rápido. Do it faster. Okay, yes. Let's see. Next. Uh huh. And keep up to date so you can get and keep, Sulma? Important feedback as you go. Important feedback as you go. Close Darwin. Cerca Darwin. Close, Dar close Darwin. Okay. Next. Siguiente. Begin training. Begin training. Your task force. Your task computer. force. Okay. Very good. That's excellent. Adriana. Okay. That's very good. Uh, let's continue. You're considering including, you're considering including in your preventing, in your preventing plan. maintenance plan. Okay, so Adriana, I'm sorry, your chances Fish. are okay. over. Ya se acabaron las oportunidades para Adriana. Your <laughs> chances are over. All right. She got so excited, right? She, do, she does it like very quickly. <laughs> All right, let's continue. 
set goals. Set goals. Set goals, Rafael. For you, preventive. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Lower the hand. Bajemos la mano. Lower the hand, please. Get the right people. Get the right people. Get the right people. Okay, Sulma? On board. On board. That's excellent. All right. Let's see two more. Dos más. Y los que no han dicho ninguna, come on. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> Using your task, using your task, using your task, Rafael. Oh my God. Force input. All right, that's excellent. Let's carry on. <laughs> Craftsman, craftsman, craftsman. Okay, Rosa. And members of production. And, and members of production. Very good. That's excellent. Okay, lower the hand, please. Thank you. Preventive maintenance plan goes into, goes into. Floor. Full effect. Full effect. That's good. Okay, full effect. That's excellent. Okay, let's see the last one. La última, the last one. Create a list. Create a list. Okay, uh, let's see Melanie. Of all the asset you have all the Four, okay, that's excellent. Okay, thank you very much, okay? You see Rosa, you got one. <laughs> all right, very good. I'm sorry for the ones who didn't get any, all right? You have to read more. Tienen que aprender a scan more, uh, more quickly, okay? A escanear más rápido. Uh, now, I want to make a reflection about this, okay? Quiero hacer una pequeña reflexión acerca de esta actividad que hicimos. Listen. En inglés, cuando leemos para comprender un texto, y en español, obviamente, right? Es importante la técnica de scanning, que es lo que estábamos haciendo, okay? Scanning is looking for important information, okay? Scanning es una técnica que se trata de buscar información importante para mí, information I care about, okay? Or important details or detalles importantes. So you were scanning in this moment. And this is a very important technique. Es una técnica muy importante para lectura comprensiva, okay? For uh, reading, okay? For reading comprehension, all right? So the idea was to play, and to read, and to have you focus, y tenerlos enfocados en la lectura, and to have you focus on the reading, okay? ¿Quién no estaba enfocado? Who was not focused? Everyone, right? Aunque no hayan adivinado, yo sé que estaban pendientes de encontrar la palabra. You were like trying to look up the, to look yes. for, the, for the word, okay? So you were doing your best, I know. Very good. So let me pass the attendance again. Le voy a pasar asistencia otra vez. Let me pass the attendance again. Para los que recién se van conectando... <laughs> Le estaba comentando a sus compañeros de que este día nos vamos a quedar hasta las 10 y 16, ¿ok? Hasta las 10 y 16 va a, va a durar la clase, ¿ok? Así que programense que vamos a terminar a las 10 y 16 la clase, ¿ok? ¿Qué? 10 y 16. El detalle es que antier eh, se me cortó el, el internet y me sacó cuando ustedes estaban trabajando en equipo. Luego volví a ingresar, pero no grabó. Entonces, con mi Safor pide el requisito que la clase esté grabada completamente, ¿ok? La, es decir, las dos horas, diez minutos, y quedaron 16 minutos que quedaron en el aire porque no estaba grabando la segunda vez, ¿ok? Entonces, hay que recuperar ese tiempo para que Safor vea que se dio la clase, ¿ok? Es un requisito, es un requirement, so I'm sorry, ¿ok? If you had plans to go to bed early today, I'm sorry for you, ¿ok? Uh, 10, 16, pero es solo por hoy, ¿ok? It's only today, no va a ser todos los días. Ah, it's viernes. only today. Es solo hoy. Sorry? Es viernes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was my internet. It wasn't working really good. Okay. So let me pass the attendance quickly. Ada Patricia? Present. Adriana? Present, teacher. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, teacher. 
Um, Melanie? Present. Darwin? Present, teacher. Flor? Present. Gloria? Here. Carla? Carla? Present, present. Margarita? Present. Ok, Margarita. Mayra? Present. María? Present. Nelson? I think he's in a meeting. Ofe Present. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. Um, Ofelia? Ofelia? Ofelia, hello. Ok, Osmin? Present, teacher. Rafael? Present. Rosa? Present. Sandra? Present, teacher. Jansi? Present. Zulma? Present. And Miguel? Present, teacher. Okay, thank you very much. All right. So, um, todos terminaron la tarea, ¿verdad? Estaba revisando y había algunos que todavía tienen 96 en la actividad número 14. Actividad número 14 es, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Yes. En el switch off. Sí. En el switch off. Si vieron, yes. el grupo, sí. ya, eh, si vieron el grupo, ya se corrigió, ¿ok? Así que si van y yeah. lo completan, ahora ya van a tener el 100%. So, I recommend you go and complete it, ¿ok? Así que vayan a completarlo, ¿ok? Para que les salga ahí el 100%, que no les quede el 96%. Estaba revisando y veía que hay como cinco que todavía tienen 96%, que no lo han corregido, ¿ok? Today. So, all right. So, if you want your okay. perfect score, si quieren su perfect score o resultado awesome. perfecto, go and check, ¿ok? Go and, and, and do it again. Vayan y lo hacen otra vez. ¿Ok? Es la actividad 14. Es activity number 14, ¿ok? Con el switch off. Ok, very good. Now, uh, for the next activity... I need full involvement or full participation, okay? Except um, Nelson está en una reunión, creo que no participará, right? Eh, Margarita? Bueno, I think she's busy too. Zulma? Yes, teacher, yes. Yes, yes. Maria Estela? María Estela, I want to make sure you will participate, ¿ok? Quiero asegurarme de que van a participar porque necesitamos hacer equipos y necesitan estar conectados. And you need to be connected, ¿ok? So, María Estela, hello. I think she has no audio, I don't know why. Ok, uh, so I come with the people who are here. Ok, listen. Uh, for this activity, um, we have... Is, yeah, ok, it's... Um, how can I tell you? Uh, it's an activity... Is an activity uh, where you will work in groups of three, okay? You are going to work in groups of three. But every member of the group, cada miembro del equipo, every member of the, of the group will have an assignment. Tendrá algo que hacer. We'll have an assignment, okay? So to make it work, para hacer trabajar la actividad o para hacer funcionar la actividad, to make it work, everybody needs to be prepared with his or her part. Todos deben estar preparados con su parte. ¿Ok? Now, listen. What are you going to do? Let me explain the activity. Let me explain the activity. Um, ok, let me share here screen. Listen. Using the same reading, usando la misma lectura, using the same reading, um, the idea is that uh, in the groups, ok, the idea is that in the groups, um, you decide, ok, if We have three different uh, roles. Tenemos tres roles diferentes. We have three different roles. We have storyteller, clarifier, and questioner. Okay? And every role has a different assignment. Y cada role tiene algo diferente que hacer. Okay? So you need to take one. Necesitan decidir cuál van a tomar en su equipo. Okay? So groups of three, three roles. So listen. Listen carefully. In case you are the storyteller, si son el storyteller, You tell the story to the group. Van a contar la historia al grupo. ¿Ok? O van a hablar acerca de la lectura al grupo. But try to do it naturally. Lo van a hacer naturalmente. No van a leer todo. No. Van a sacar ideas y van a hablar acerca de la historia. You will talk about the story. ¿Ok? So in this case, la lectura que estábamos leyendo. The reading. ¿Ok? Second. So that's the storyteller. 
va a hablar acerca del, de la lectura, de Storyteller, de Clarifier. ¿Cuál va a ser el, el trabajo del Clarifier? Si usted es el Clarifier, in case you are the Clarifier, um, va a buscar todo el nuevo vocabulario, unas 15, 10, 15 palabras, y lo va a compartir con el grupo. Y va a dar el significado o la traducción, puede ser en español, ¿ok? The translation in Spanish, y puede dar un ejemplo si quiere. You can give one example if you want, ¿ok? Yeah. ya That is the clarifier. Ese sería el trabajo del clarifier. ¿Ok? Now, imagine you are the questioner. Imagínense que les toca el rol del questioner. El questioner um, will ask questions to the teammates. Le va a crear algunas preguntas, al menos unas siete preguntas abiertas o cerradas pueden ser. Seven questions, ¿ok? Y al terminar, cuando todos estemos compartiendo, le va a hacer las preguntas al resto del equipo, ¿ok? So, the idea is that when you are ready, la idea es que cuando todos estén listos, el storyteller, el clarifier y el questioner, uh, the idea is that you share your part. La idea es que compartan su parte. So, for example, the storyteller va, va, va a hablar acerca de la lectura. Ok, will speak about the reading. Yeah? The clarifier va a dar el nuevo vocabulario al grupo y las traducciones y ejemplos, ¿ok? En the questioner y el questioner le va a hacer al menos entre seis o siete preguntas de la lectura del grupo, ¿ok? Yeah. So, do you have any questions? Do you have any questions? Teacher, con la lectura que acabamos de hacer, o sea, tomando eso para. Yes, it's with the reading. Tomando esta lectura. Yes, uh -huh. tomando, tomando como. Bueno, eh, va a ser es? acerca de la lectura que tenemos. Yes, it's about okay. the reading we have. Page number, teacher. Okay. It's page number uh, 37, I think. Let me confirm. 37. Page number 37. Okay. So, um, do you have any question about the activity? Teacher, todo el diálogo. Step. All the conversation, the I mean, the, the, the reading, toda la lectura, all the reading. But listen, pero si en, ahorita vamos a repartir los roles, ahorita solo les preguntas nada más a ver si tienen alguna duda, ¿ok? So, um, it's about the reading, ¿ok? Es toda la lectura. But if you, are, if you are the storyteller, si ustedes van a ser el storyteller, sorry, solo van a sacar los puntos más importantes y para hablar de la lectura, to speak about the reading, ¿ok? No van a leer todo así como está, no. The idea is that you give that you talk about the reading, que hablen de la lectura, that you talk about the reading, like naturally, okay? Any other question? No? So we have two, two, uh, we have two parts. In one part, in the first part, you will prepare uh, for, the, for sharing. Se van a preparar para compartir. I will give you like 15 minutes, 15 or 20 minutes. Le voy a dar de 15 a 20 minutos, like 15 or 20 minutes, okay? And then, We will go to the groups and you will share. Vamos a ir a equipos y ustedes van a compartir tu parte, ¿ok? You will take turns. Van a tomar turnos. You will take turns, ¿ok? Any question? No? No. Ok. No. Ok, let's see. The idea is that we work in groups of three. Si algún equipo queda de dos, solo hacen dos roles nada más. Eliminan uno. You delete one, ¿ok? Eliminan uno de los roles. Can be the clarifier. O pueden eliminar el... Ajá. El, tal vez el questioner pueden eliminar, ¿ok? Porque es el menos importante de los tres, de questioner. Si quedan en parejas, if you say in pairs, ¿ok? Any question? No. So, solo Margarita y Nelson no trabajarán entonces en la actividad. Serían 19. 7 por 3, 18. Vamos a hacer 7 equipos, entonces. 7 por 3, 21, perdón, oh my God. 6 por 3, 18. Ay, yes, okay. Oh my God. Ok, 16, ok. Vamos a hacer 6. No, but you are 20. 19. Yeah, 16, ok. 6 equipos, ok. So please, if you are 4, va a quedar uno de 4. Tal vez el storyteller que queden dos para el storyteller, ok. Now listen. Vamos a ir al equipo solo para que decidan qué rol van a tomar. Luego regresamos y van a trabajar aquí. Y después regresamos otra vez a los equipos para que compartan, ok. Ya. Yeah. Ahorita solo vayan a decir quién va a ser el storyteller, el questioner y el clarifier. Eso es todo lo que van a hacer ahorita, ¿ok? ¿Ya? Yeah. Ok, let's go then. Vamos entonces a decir, go to decide. Le voy a dar un minuto nada más solo para que decidan. Just to decide, ¿ok? Just one minute to decide. Ok. 
Okay, let's go. Me quedan muy grandes los equipos, me quedan de cuatro, creo. Algunos me quedan de cuatro, that's a problem. That's a big problem. Hold on a second. Hello, teacher. Hello. Sí, es que algunos me quedan. Ah, ahora sí. Now we can do it, ¿ok? Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. ¿Cuáles eran los tres? Recuerden. Sorry. ¿Cuáles eran los tres roles? Eh, Era, it was storyteller, clarifier, storyteller. and questioner. Storyteller, clarifier, and questioner. Clarifier solo hace los, los el vocabulario, el vocabulario, the vocabulary, the new vocabulary, <laughs> and examples, <laughs> and examples with the new vocabulary. Y ejemplos. En examples, okay. ya. Yeah. Bueno. Ah, entonces, <risa> nada, ya digo que sí. <risa> nada, ya sí. Ok. No sé si se queda a complicar esto. <risa> Lástima que no se puede sortear, ¿verdad? En papelito. <risa> Rock paper, rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Ok, hagámoslo a uh, par y no, no como digamos. Piedra, papel, o tijera. <laughs> a ver si sale. Ay, elegí el dos. Las palabras. Yes. La, vocabulario, yes. new vocabulario. Vocabulario. <laughs> Yes, Sandra. What, what is? Habemos yeah. cuatro. Four. Two Teacher, stories. Yo Wait. estaba en otro, pero me sacó. Sí, es que vi que aquí está, es que vi que María no le costaba conectarse. Pensé que no le estaba funcionando la, el, el, Ajá, no tenía me, conexión. Me cuesta, pero. Sí, por eso es que te, te mandé acá a ti, Alzalia. Y Margarita, y Margarita está en otra cosa, creo, ahorita. Okay. Okay. Ajá. Ajá, pero pueden, Viene aquí manejando. pueden, ajá, pueden haber yeah. dos storytellers. Pueden haber dos storytellers, un clarifier y un questioner. O pueden haber dos questioners, un storyteller y un clarifier. Ustedes deciden, you decide. Pero clarifier solo uno, ¿ok? Teacher, está... Ah, y clarifier. Ok. Clarifier solo uno. Yes. Contador de historia. Storyteller. Narrador. Narrador. Contador, no narrador. Narrador de la historia, ya. Storyteller. Ah... Clasificador solo uno, dice. Yes. Clarificador es la cosa. Clarificador. Yes. Clarifier only one. Clarifier. Maybe you can be two storytellers or, okay. or two questioners, okay? Chicas. Okay, I, I am clarifier. Voy a empezar a buscar las palabras. Clarifier. Okay. Vamos a ver. Uy, ya. Me It's only to decide. Okay? Okay. Ahorita es solo para Asale. decidir. Asalia, ah, ¿qué ¿Ah? ¿Quién va a hacer este? Entonces queda. No, no, no. ¿Quién va sí. a contar el ah, O si no, ahí lo que gusten ustedes. No sé. No, 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 ya estuvo. Cuestión era Asalia, Sandra en Angela Storyteller y Clarifield ah, okay. uh -huh. María. Ok. Bye. 
Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Igual, igual nos vamos a ayudar. Yes. Bye, bye, bye chicas. Bye. <laughs> Se apuren con la historia para poder yo preguntar. Ya <laughs> <laughs>no, is that necessary? Por favor, sí. Teacher. Okay. Yeah. Please. Teacher. Yeah. Yo realmente no comprendí muy bien la actividad. What is your role, Flor? ¿Cuál es tu rol? Questioner. Questioner, ¿ok? So la idea es que tú, en base a la lectura, crees siete preguntas para tus compañeros. Y tú se las vas a hacer cuando vayamos a trabajar en equipo otra vez, ¿ok? Ya, yeah. te vas a hacer esa. Tú de, obviamente, obviously, you need to have the answer. Necesitas tener la respuesta. You need to have the answer, okay? Mm, okay. Yes? Because the questions are for, for the group. The idea is that you ask the questions and they answer the questions, right? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. The clarif yeah, y el, and the clarifier. En el caso del storyteller. You read the story and you tell the story. Van a leer bien la historia y la van a contar en sus propias palabras, in your own words. Okay? okay. Maybe you can make it really short. Pueden hacer la cortita, okay? No, no, no deben decir ah, todo. Okay. You don't have to say everything, okay? Ah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Me metí un problema porque no te tengo que traducir, teacher. Okay. <laughs> the problem. It's okay, no problem. No problem. I mean, you don't have to, storytellers, uh, you don't have to tell all the story. No, I mean, get only important ideas. Get only important ideas, okay? And then you share the important okay, ideas okay. about the story, okay? You don't have to say, uh, to tell okay. everything. No deben decirlo todo. You don't have to tell everything. But the most important, uh, you have to do it, right? Like the most important information. Teacher, what is the story? Sorry? What is the story? Is the reading on page 37, la lectura que estábamos viendo. The reading on page ah, okay. 37. It's not a story exactly, right? Ah, okay. The, the idea okay. of the activity is to have a story. But since uh, the idea here is to practice with the reading, okay, we have. Okay? Okay. Si quieren, hazle un screenshot para que pueda salirme en la pantalla principal so I can go to the, to the main station, okay? All right. Okay, everyone. Continue working. Ok, la idea es que cuando todos estén listos, nos vamos a ir a trabajar con el mismo equipo y van a desarrollar su parte. You will develop your part, ok? You will take turns, tomarán turnos. You will take turns to develop your, your part.
uh, just to let you know that we have eight minutes left, okay? We have eight minutes, okay? Eight minutes for you to take teacher, time in consideration, okay? Sorry? Let's start, teacher. Let's start. Que empecemos ya, let's start. No, no que me asustó. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, continue. So take time in consideration. In eight minutes, we start, okay? Eight minutes.
teacher. Tell me. Today, I I feel under the weather. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. Oh my God, I'm sorry. I, I think I think I think that I'm I'm going to get flu because I I was missing, was missing, was missing. <laughs> Yes, for sure. Yeah. For that, yeah. That's like, those are like the symptoms for the flu. Yes, yes. But... Oh, I'm sorry. Drink a lot of, <laughs> drink a lot of tea. Yes. Ginger, okay. Ginger tea. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And a sick as a dog. Uh, we have one minute, okay? One minute. So don't worry. If you don't have the seven questions, uh, maybe you have like four questions or five questions, okay? So you can do it with the four or five questions you have. Uh, if you have like maybe seven or eight words, uh, the clarifiers, it's okay, no problem, okay? Share what you have. Compartan lo que tienen. Share what you have. And the, for the storytellers, the same. Share what you have. Hay que compartir lo que tienen también los storytellers, okay? Just two minutes, okay, for the last arrangements. Dos minutos para las últimas preparaciones. Two minutes for the last things, okay, or changes you want to make. Okay, I'm sorry, time is over, all right? So uh, so we advance. All right, I just want to know, um, uh, please, on, on the chat, on the chat, uh, can you write uh, the names of the group members, please? Okay, only one person, all right? So, um, or, or maybe everybody, I, I will just see, all right? So on the chat, can you write the, the, the members of the group, please? Do you remember your members? Recuerdan quien estaba con ustedes, pero you remember who was with you? Don't say no, please. No, digan no. Don't say no, please. Yes, okay. So write the members of the chat on the chat, please. Ophelia, Michelle, and Sulma. Okay, team number one. Ophelia, Michelle, and Sulma, number one. Son el equipo número uno. Ophelia, Michelle, and Sulma. All right. Uh, let me see. Okay, teacher. Uh, Flor, Rafa, and Mayra, number two. Flor, Rafa, and Mayra, number two. Rafael and Mayra, number two. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me see. Um, Adriana, Yancy, and Miguel, number three. Adriana, Yancy, Miguel, number three. And the others? Los demás on the chat, please. 
write the names on the chat, please. I have only three groups in this moment. I only have three groups. And the other groups? It's gone. They're gone. No, I had six groups, so I am missing three. Ah, Rosa, Darwin, uh, Rosa, Darwin, and who? Came back, came back from Rosa, Ada. So, sorry, Ada. Ada, Ada, Rosa, and Darwin. Okay, you are number four. Okay, Ada, Rosa, and Darwin, you are number four, okay? Number four. Uh, number five, Gloria, Carla, and Osmin. Gloria, Carla, Osmin, number five, okay? Number five. And okay. finally, Asalia, Maria, and Angela. Asalia, Maria, and Angela. Y quien más? Había uno de cuatro, right? So you are number six, okay? So let me repeat the groups. So please, when I open the, the breakout rooms, select the group I told you, okay? Select the group I'm telling you in these moments, okay? Number one, Ofelia, Michelle, and Zulma. Number two, Flor, Rafa, and Mayra. Number three, Adriana, Jansi, and Miguel. Number uh, four, Ada, Rosa, and Darwin, okay? And number five, Gloria, Carla, and Osmin. Number six, Azalia, Maria, and Angela, all right? Yeah, ready? So I will give you yeah. 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, I will finish the time, okay? So please, take the time. Lleven el tiempo, no se vaya a tomar solo uno, los 10 minutos, no, okay? Separate the time, like three, three, and three Sandra minutes, también. okay? Sorry? Sandra yes. también. Sandra, in which, con quien va Sandra? Con Sandra? Mingo, con Angie y, y María Estela. All right, so you are in number... Uh, pues sí, si otros tres. Sandra, si you are... Sandra, you are... Number six, Sandra. Number six, six okay? Sí. Number yes. six. Very good. So you have ten minutes. Take three minutes each. Lleven bien el tiempo. Si no solo uno, se va a tomar los diez minutos, okay? So te, please, check the time, okay? Ten okay. minutes and you finish, okay? Sí, are you ready? Sí. Yes? Uy, no, Sorry? Question teacher. Question teacher. Yeah, yeah, tell me. Yes, eh, el, el, ¿cómo se llama? El primer, el primer rol, el de... Storyteller. Storyteller. Story yes. Bueno, eh, para mí ha sido un gran dolor de cabeza en el sentido de que <laughs> como que he recreado un poco la historia porque no puedo decir la historia tal cual. Yeah, no it's okay. Lectura. That, that's the idea. Pero en ese, en ese sentido, no sé si el, 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 ¿cómo se llama? El vocabulario debe de ser de lo que yo voy a exponer o el vocabulario es de la lectura original. No, no, it doesn't matter. You can paraphrase. No you can paraphrase, no problem, ¿ok? okay. Paraphrasing okay. is okay. Está okay si okay. parafrasean, no problem, ¿ok? It's okay. Ok, All right. gracias. Any Thank other, you. yeah, it's okay. Any other question? No? No. All right, let's go then to work. No. Ok, so please, select the correct room. Elijan el equipo correcto, ¿ok? Select the correct room, please. ¿Ok? Yes. Let's go. Teacher, ¿en cuál íbamos a entrar? Uh, Melanie, Sandrita y yo, ¿en cuál? Están en el número Melanie, Sandra, right? Six, number six. ¿No les aparece okay. a ustedes la opción de entrar? No, no, no. Ah, ahorita, ahorita vamos a entrar. Ok. Number six, Melanie, Sandra, right? Six, number six. Six, number six. Ada, ¿le aparece? Perdón, teacher, estaba concentrada en el trabajo. ¿Aparece la opción de entrar? ¿Al grupo? No, no. no. María, no, María. 
Eh, Rosa, ¿a qué equipo? Aldeada. Which number? Solo Darwin. Solo Darwin. Which, num Cuatro. Which, Cuatro. which number? Four. Four. Okay. Yeah. Um, Osmin, which group? ¿Cuál grupo? Number five. Okay, let me send you. Okay. Ada, which group? Four. Gloria, which group? Teacher, se me fue. ¿Me pueden volver a... para Gloria, poder entrar? Yes. Gloria, which group? Gloria, ¿qué grupo? Ok, ya. ya. Ada, ok, veamos. Todavía aparece, Ada. Eh, Dele aceptar lo... ahí. Sí, porque ¿Podría? ya está asignada. Ah, ya está asignada, solo okay. del entrar. Click on enter. ¿Ya? Did you find it? Tailed. Record of the progress of each equipment. And it's best to organize everything in some software program. Okay. Okay. That's it. I'm next. I'm a clarifier mm -hmm. and uh, I list the, some words, for example, set goals, eh, significa fijar metas. Eh, for example, in the history, eh, say what you hope to achieve using the system. Eh, por ejemplo, decía que podíamos establecer eh, objetivos de qué era lo que teníamos que lograr al eh, eh, como permitirle a que toda la gente pudiera usar el sistema. ¿Qué era lo que esperábamos lograr con eso? La siguiente es Task Force, que significa como grupo de trabajo. O, ajá, como, como en nuestro caso, por ejemplo, somos un task, for, task force. Task force, ajá. Tagging eh, significa etiquetar. En la historia decía que eh, en el paso 3 se podía eh, etiquetar todo el equipo. Decía tagging the equipment en assets. Y assets significa activos, que son todos los eh, herramientas o todo lo que hay en, en la empresa, o en ese caso todo lo que se le va a dar mantenimiento. Pueden ser computadoras, eh, escritorios, eh, sillas, todo eso. Eh, otra era keeping mind, que significaba... Eh, la R de más, pero es, pero es lograr. Luego está go through, que eh, yo entendía cómo atravesar, pero en base a este contexto, cuando busqué la traducción, es como revisar. Revisar eh, lo, lo que serían las instalaciones, go through your facility and inventory, que sería revisar las instalaciones y el inventario de todo el equipamiento. Entonces, eh, me pareció interesante resaltarlo para que lo pudiéramos revisar. Luego, otra que me encanta es As You Go, que significa sobre la marcha, cuando se utiliza en ese contexto. Y eh, otra, pues, como que si fuera compuesta, es Carry Out, que es eh, llevar a cabo. Así es que estas son eh, las palabras que quise resaltar de la lectura para armar el vocabulario. No sé qué les parece. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. But the, the question 
I writing in, in number one. What do you need to start your preventive maintenance plan? One step, two step, three. Uh, uh, teacher, is, aquí, uh -huh. aquí, the, ajá, aquí the tenemos una situación, ya que está aquí. Uh -huh. okay, Fíjese que va, estamos ya, ya vimos, eh, ya estamos viendo que Yancy ya sacó un vocabulario, oh, tiene ahí unos ejemplos, pero ahorita con Adriana, Adriana ha sacado preguntas, pero Cavalía sacó las preguntas de eso, de, de, de la lectura original, ¿verdad? Porque solo eso tenía. Entonces, la, la, la duda que yo tengo es, esas preguntas las tenemos que contestar nosotros dos que estamos... Yes. Entonces, tenemos que dedicar más tiempo para ir a ver la respuesta, porque ella you sabe need... la pregunta, pero yes. nosotros nos dedicamos a hacer otras actividades, teacher. But you, you read the text. Uh, listen. Pero, yes, but, yes. Uh, but you read, read the text. text. Ajá, ah, read the text. The text. La idea es que todos leyeran el texto en base a lo que iban a hacer. No, claro, claro. Indirect, es... Indirectamente, ah. right? Indirectly. So the idea is that... Ah, easy, easy, easy. Very easy. Okay. Ah, okay. 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 The number two. Yes, uh -huh. the number two. <laughs> Who should you include in your maintenance plans? Who That's... should you include in your maintenance plans? Plan. Who should... Ah, who? Eh, who, who, who ¿Quién should, uh -huh. ¿Quiénes son los que implementan el plan de mantenimiento? Algo así. You include. No, include. Ah, que include. Include in your maintenance plan. Plan. Who should you include in the maintenance plan? The people. ¿Quiénes están the incluidos people. en uh -huh. el plan de mantenimiento? Ajá, ¿quién deberías ah, incluir? ¿A quiénes deberías? Ajá. Who should so, you include? Management. Main yes. names, manager, main names, technician, and other staff. Mm -hmm. uh, other staff who understand the way your system operates. Todas las la personas yes. que están en el proceso, que son mencionadas en el proceso. Y todos los miembros de la producción en los que controlan la producción. En inglés. En inglés. En inglés. En inglés. No, no, solo para entender que si esa es la parte, porque yeah. digamos sí, que quien, sí, sí. quien yes. ahorita tiene la idea de la respuesta solo. I'm Adriana. kidding, I'm kidding. Yes. I'm just kidding, okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Continue. Okay. Why, number three, question number three. Why is important have a preventive maintenance plan? ¿Por qué? Mm -hmm. Question number two. What is the name? Of a ship number two of the reading. Set, set goals. ¿Cuál es el paso? ¿Cómo se llama el paso número dos de la lectura? Uh -huh. Set goals. Set goals for your preventing my maintaining plus play. Number three. Who should be included for maintenance? Who should? Be include for maintenance. Eh, ¿Quiénes se deben incluir para realizar el mantenimiento? Eh, sería, the, right, the right people on board. The, um, in line number two of paragraph number one, top management, management manager. Maintenance center and other stuff. Uh -huh. Okay. Lo de llamar lo a what day says. Everyone, ¿en qué párrafo más o menos está? Sí. En la en el uno, en el dos, en el tres. Eh, está en el paso tres. Tres. Eh, perdón, en, en en el en el dos, en el dos. No, perdón, perdón, el 3 exactamente en el 3, perdón. Vaya, me, me repite por favor. Everyone, everyone loves a waffle, a waffle day, say. Me parece en el, en el búsquelo, por favor, en el, en el 2, a inicios del 2 creo que está así. Es que yo no tengo el libro, no que estoy, voy al chat. Ok. 
Everyone love, sí, en el dos búsquelo, por favor. Everyone love a waffle they say. Ahí está. Y el number four. Espérenme, es que ese no lo encuentro. Está bien. Eh, en step 2, búsquelo. Step 2, paso 2. La primera, la primera frase, creo que es. Everyone. First inputs. First inputs. Quiero corroborar una que les esté. Richard viene a traernos. Finish, dice. No aparecieron, voy por él. Voy a reír. Ya, yeah, you finished. Oh, Did you finish? No? Moment, Por un poquito. Okay. One minute. <laughs> one minute. Okay, one minute. One minute. One minute. One minute. Yes. One minute, please. Okay. ¿Qué pasó hasta el día? Estoy traduciendo. Ah, okay, qué traducción. Traducción. Mm. Es que no me deja. Ahí voy, 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 voy. Quiero ver hasta la 4 tradujo y voy por la 5. Voy, las, voy por la 5. Mm. Por la 5. Por la 5. Por la 5. Ay, no me deja, está muy largo. No me deja traducirlo. ¿Por qué? La 5. Ya casi en lo que pone a hablar el teacher, ya termino. Pero... Niñas, ¿están ahí? Porque no las sí, veo. Sí, sí, sí. Yes. 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 Creo que el teacher quiere que nos salgamos. Salir de las alas. ¿Y nosotros no tenemos que salir o...? o... No, no. No, no, creo que no. Just Ahí continue, no ok. Just continue. The, the time will get you out. Ok, continue. 28 seconds. ¿Cómo le dice alivio? Ya voy por las seis. Finish, finish. Ya con sol, ah, eh, sí, sí. Eh, eh, rápido las el tiempo. Ya son las 10 pasadas. No la va a mandar el WhatsApp. Acuérdense que hoy no la va a mandar. Okay. Um, so I hope everyone finished, okay? Uh, so did everyone finish? Todos terminaron, did everyone finish? Yes. Yes, all right, very good. Thank yes. you very much. Excellent. Okay, so uh, look, basically the idea of this activity is to practice, is to practice listening, to practice speaking, to practice reading, to practice vocabulary, okay? Pronunciation. So basically with this activity, we practice everything, okay? We practice everything. And that's the, the main idea, okay? That's the main idea of this um, activity. So I hope you like the activity and I hope you learn with the activity, okay? Which is like the most, uh, the most important, okay? Very good. So thank you very much, okay? For taking the time to share, okay? And for preparing for this activity. Now, let me pass the attendance quickly, okay? It's not time, okay? Todavía no nos vamos, nos faltan siete minutos todavía. We're missing seven minutes. Talking about the seven minutes, hablando de los siete minutos. Rápido pasa el tiempo, right? Time really flies. And a question, um, teacher. Yes, Can what is it? Uh, 
O sea, las preguntas eran en base a lo que leímos en yes. la página 27. That's right. The questions okay. were about the reading. Eran acerca de la lectura. Yes. O sea, un, un ejemplo. You know uh, what they say? O sea, tú sabes lo que dicen ellos. Está en step number one. Esa era correcta una pregunta. Mm, maybe it's too, I, it's okay, but I think it's too general, all right? Um, yeah. Maybe you, you have to be more specific about the reading, okay? Like, for example, I heard that question, uh, I heard this question, who should be included in the maintenance plan, for example? Okay. Who should be included in the maintenance plan, okay? ¿Quién debería ser incluido, okay? Who should be included? It's a question, like, about the, the reading. Maybe you need, you need it to be more specific, okay? También necesitaba ser un poquito más específic. Yeah? Yes, yeah. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Okay, let me pass the attendance quickly. Ada Patricia? Present. Okay, no se me vayan a salir todavía no es hora. It's not time yet. Oh, and I almost forgot. Eh, fíjense que Nelson va manejando ahorita y a él le toca la sesión privada hoy de 10 y 16 a 10 y 26. No sé si hay algún voluntario que, que quiera sustituirlo para que lo haga después. Eh, Los que quedan para la yo, otra semana. Yo no, tengo, yo no tengo sesión. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Ah. So, Miguel. Uh -huh. O Miguel, si alguien más tú... quiere cambiarla, no, no, tampoco tengo problema. Ajá, no sé si alguien de los que estén la otra semana desearía cambiarlo, si no dejamos ajá, a Miguel. Porque si no, le voy a dejar sin chance a Nelson también, eso ajá. sí pasaría. Ya, yeah, ajá, ese sería el, el problema. Entonces, no sé si alguien, yo sé que va a ser de 10 y 16 a 10 y 26, pero si alguien quiere Teacher. ayudar a Nelson. Nelson. Teacher, buenas noches. Buenas noches. Este, ayer intercambiamos con la Patricia, ella me oh, ayudó. Sí es. es cierto, no lo recordaba, lo siento mucho, I didn't remember. Thank you very much. Thank you, Nelson. Okay. So, um, Teacher. so, Ada. Teacher, si Miguel puede, si Miguel quiere ahora, no hay problema. No pero, no, pero es que la dejaría fuera Ada. Ese es el problema. Sí, ajá, ahora le tocaría Ada porque ayer tomó el espacio suyo. Eh, sure, Así que Ada, entonces, I didn't say anything. No dije nada. So, Ada, it's your turn today. Ahora es su turno entonces, Ada. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. So, um, very good. So, let me continue passing the attendance. Okay. Adriana. Present. Ana Michelle. Present. Ángela. Present, teacher. Azalia Melanie. Azalia. Darwin. Present teacher, no, oh, no oh. se me quedaba. Okay, no problem. No problem. Flor. Present. Gloria. Here. Carla. Carla. Present, present. Margarita is present. Maria. Present. Okay, Maria. Present. Mayra. Present teacher. Nelson. Present teacher. Ofelia. Here teacher. Very good. Osmin. Present teacher. Great. Rafael. Present. Rosa. Present. Ok. Sandra. Sandra. Present teacher. Ok. Jansi. Present. Zulma. Present. And Miguel. Present teacher. Okay, very good. So we have uh, like three or four minutes. Okay. Uh, the last thing for today. Okay, listen. Um, you talk about a lot uh, about the reading, right? You talk and you did some exercises about the reading. So um, for this exercise, I guess we won't complete. Okay. Um, for this exercise, we are not going to complete because you read the reading a lot. Ya leyeron demasiado la lectura, okay? You read the reading too much, okay? So let's focus here. So listen, um, idioms, okay? And we continue with idioms, part two. In idioms, uh, we have studied that idioms don't have a literal translation, right? Idioms don't have a literal translation, okay? And here we have other idioms, okay? For example, we have the idiom... Um, Wiped out. Hold on a second, let me get the, the pen here, the pencil. Okay, so we have the idiom wiped out, okay? And wiped out is very tired, like very tired. Like for example, imagine right now you are very tired. You say, I am wiped out in this moment. I am wiped out in this moment, like very tired, okay? Wiped out, wiped out. Good, second, to have, a lot 
on one's plate. En vez de decir once, podrían decir my or your. Ok, to have a lot on one's plate. That means to have a lot to do, tener muchas cosas que hacer. Imagine you have a lot of work, tienen mucho trabajo. So you can say, I have a lot on my plate. I have a lot on my plate. There's a lot of work in the company, okay? I have a lot on my plate, okay? Now let's continue with the next. Settle down. Settle down is like to calm down, okay? Maybe you are working a lot. You are working a lot. Están trabajando demasiado. And I tell you, hey, come on, settle down. Hey, come on, settle down. It's like calm down, take it easy, all right? Settle down, yeah? It's calm down, good. Next. Hang in there, hang in there. It's to be patient, okay? Be patient, okay? You say, oh my God. You say, I have, um, imagine, imagine you are, you are waiting for something. Están esperando algo con ansias, tal vez, I don't know, un crédito or alguna remesa, okay? Or maybe alguna posición de trabajo mejor. So I tell you, hey, come on, don't get anxious. No se pongan ansiosos. Hang in there. Hang in there. Be patient, okay? Hang in there, all right? Good. Uh -huh. Let's go. Let's go to the next. To keep one's head, I like this one. To keep your head above water. It's like to survive, okay? Yes, to keep your head above water. Sometimes uh, bosses are so arrogant. Algunas veces, algunas veces, algunos, tal vez algunos jefes, right? They bother a lot. Son como que no, no se soportan, so... You just try to keep your head above water. Solo tratan de mantener la cabeza a flote, okay? So you try to keep your head above water. And by this, once you say your or my, okay? Or maybe with your work, con su trabajo, mucho trabajo. So I just try to survive. I just try to keep my head above water, okay? Next, to scale back. Um, one's hours, okay? Is to reduce the number of hours one works. Imagine you work too many hours. Imagínense que trabajan demasiadas horas. And you say, oh, no, no, it's too much. Es demasiado. I need to scale back my hours. I need to scale back my hours. That means I need to reduce the number of hours I work, okay? I need to scale back my hours, okay? And the next one is stressed out. I am stressed out. That means Easy, right? I am stressed out. Estoy muy estresado. I am stressed out, okay? And the last one. Sleep one's mind. is like be forgotten, okay? Ser olvidado. ¿Quiénes son olvidados aquí? Who is forgotten here? <laughs> Rafa says, right? So imagine you say, Oh, Miguel, I forgot your birthday. I forgot your birthday. I sleep my mind. I sleep my Can mind again, okay? Yes, I Can sleep I my mind again. Okay, I cannot. <laughs> yes, definitely the agenda, right? Uh, that's why I use an agenda Lista. because I am, I am, I sleep my mind. So I use an agenda because I commonly sleep my mind. Okay, yo comúnmente soy olvidado. I commonly sleep my mind. Okay, good. So these are the idioms we have. Okay, very good. Now, um, listen. Usando estos idioms. Usando estos idioms, el día de mañana voy a, voy a postear la, el siguiente writing. Se lo pueden hacer el lunes si quieran, ¿ok? Eh, le voy a postear dos writing. En el primer writing, en discussion, va, usando los idioms, va a escribir tres ejemplos, ¿ok? Eso lo, lo pueden hacer luego, usando estos idioms que están acá, ¿ok? These idioms. Y en la segunda actividad, va a escribir acerca de los problemas, ¿ok? Un párrafo acerca de problemas comunes con maquinaria. Y para eso pueden usar igual estos idioms, pueden usar los phrasal verbs. Es común usar todo lo que hemos visto en la unidad, básicamente acá, ¿ok? Son dos cosas. Así que en discusión les voy a dejar esto para que lo, para que lo completen en writing, ¿ok? This is on page number 38. ¿Cuántos problemas, teacher? En in, in this one. Yes. Maybe you can write like, Ahí le va a decir una indicación, va a ser como unos dos, tres problemas, like two or three problems, ¿ok? Yeah. Ok. Very good. So, that's it for today. Terminamos y se hicieron las 10 y 19, ¿ok? 
So uh, I don't want to take more of your time. No quiero quitarles más de su tiempo. I know you are tired. Sé que están cansados. So thank you very much. Remember, next week is the last. La siguiente semana es la última. Así que conectarse toda la semana. Okay? To get connected all the week. Okay? Del módulo. Okay. Of the module. Okay? Yeah. So everyone, yeah. solo se me queda Ada. Entonces, thank you very much for connecting. Good night. Take care and goodbye. Bye. Good night, good night teacher. Good, good night, everyone. Bye. Good Bye. Good weekend. Good night. Bye. Good night. Happy Have a good weekend. Happy weekend. Bye, teach. Bye bye. Have a nice weekend. Okay, Ada. So, um, well, let's start. Empecemos entonces. So, this space is okay. for you. Siento porque la dejé tan noche, pero no había otra solución. There was no solution, ah. okay? No, yo, yo entiendo, teacher. Lo que pasa es que sí, ya hasta ahora ya uno ya no... Sí, ya está bien. Ya no da más, ¿verdad? Yo entiendo, okay? So if you have any questions then... Ah, sí. Adelante. Ah, este... Lo único que, no sé, siento que me cuesta más, a mí... El, Lo que más me cuesta, aparte del vocabulario, ¿verdad? Que estoy trabajando en eso, es um, eh, formular las oraciones. Ahí sí siento que me cuesta porque este, el orden, ¿verdad? De las palabras, a veces siento que, que eso es lo que a mí me está molestando más de la cuenta. Ok, muy bien, entiendo. Y está haciendo algo en específico para mejorar esa parte de la, la estructura. Hola. Hola, Ada. Hola. Hola, hola. ¿Me escucha? Hola, hola. El micrófono, de micrófono. ¿Hoy sí? Hoy sí, hoy sí, escucho. Como que se le había ido la señal. Sí, así es. Este, okay. No, yo le estaba diciendo, ¿verdad? No sé si me logró escuchar. Sí, 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 sí logré escuchar. Eh, una pregunta nada más. Yes. Eh, bueno, no sé si está haciendo algo específico para mejorar en la estructura en la, o en la estructura eh, de oraciones. Bueno, lo que me he dedicado últimamente, teacher, es a escuchar audios, vamos a decir así, ¿verdad? <risa> este... Um, estoy estoy tratando de, de hecho me he puesto a ver como videos uh -huh. videos verdad este pero no sé no sé si eso será suficiente pero videos en general de qué o no no hay un tema específico eh, o son videos así de lo que no le o sea yo... no no teacher cómo le digo Este, empecé en YouTube a buscar y empecé desde el, una mentira, desde el abecedario, entonces ahí dan, dan, dan frases. Eso es lo que mm. estoy escuchando. Ok. Y estoy viendo frases, mm. pero, ¿verdad? Pero todavía siento que me falta. Sí, sí. Sí, porque en, hasta ahorita lo que, lo, lo, lo que logro entender es que, lo que en lo que tiene problema básicamente es en gramática, estructura gramatical, ¿ok? Así es. Ajá, vaya. Así es. Eh, Entonces, eh, lo que podemos hacer es que puede empezar a ver videos, está bien ver videos, pero empezar de temas básicos de gramática. Que hablando del verbo to be, que le dé ejemplos, que le hable cosas del verbo to be, alguien, video. Del presente simple, del, de, de lo que se ha visto, ok, temas básicos, ok. Para eso, uh -huh. yo conozco una página que se llama invid.com, In bid.com, ok, yo se la puedo compartir luego si me escribe un mensajito eh, la idea de esta la idea de esta página contiene videos solo de gramática o de vocabulario ok, va de básico, intermedio hasta avanzado eh, uh -huh. la, idea, la idea en sí es de que mire el video digamos del tema específico que usted quiere saber ya sea del presente continuo del presente simple y a la misma vez en la página le tira como un un, un mini test Un, un, un test pequeñito así del tema que le explicaron como en unos 6, 7 minutos y en el momento usted toma un, en el momento toma un test de ese de ese tema en específico ok, y lo completa para ver cómo para ver si ha comprendido o no ha comprendido y usted puede también hacer cosas como escribiendo ejemplos 
Digo esto porque si lo que le falta es estructura, hay que ir a trabajar gramática entonces. Sí. Okay. Sí, me repite la, eh, me lo, me lo, uh, ¿cómo le digo yo? ¿En dónde me dijo que lo buscara? No, no, yo le puedo mandar el enlace, me escribe un mensajito. Ajá. Ajá. En o el, en el la... grupo de chat. Vaya, déjenme buscarla ahorita mejor. Para, para, para que ya quedemos de una vez. Y yo se lo sugiero de una vez. Ahora vamos a ver. Ah, la verdad. Yes. Veamos. Usted es la que me mandó la conversación, ¿verdad? No. Ah, sí. Este, sí, no, sí. no, es, fue a Salia, creo que fue la que le mandó la conversación. Fue a Salia que me la mandó. Sí, estaba pues. en, en mi grupo. Sí, sí, es cierto, va, pero pues aquí creo que estoy buscando el número ahorita. Patricia Linares aparece, ¿verdad? Sí. En, en, el, en el WhatsApp. Ok, vaya, déjeme no. compartirle. No aparece así. Sí, Patricia Linares. Ah, ok, ok. Escuché que me dijo no. Vale. Vale, mire, ahí le voy a compartir ahorita el sitio web. Vaya, entonces usted se va a ir a Topics y puede buscar los temas más, como más, mmm, más básicos, ¿ok? Para que vaya de lo básico a lo, a lo complejo, como decimos, ¿verdad? A lo complejo, sí. Ajá, vaya, ahorita estoy... Vaya, revisa si le cayó el, el enlace. Eh, sí. Ya ahorita ya me cayó. Ok, perfecto. Vaya, entonces usted ahí va a entrar y no, no, no lo hago ahorita, no, no le enseño cómo porque no, no, no hay autorización para, para mostrar mm, claro. cosas así. ¿verdad? Pero eh, eh, lo que va a entrar ahí y se va a temas, arriba dice topics, ¿ok? En la parte uh -huh. superior, ah, en la parte superior dice topics, le hace clic en topics y ahí le van a aparecer los diferentes temas. Usted trate de ir a temas que ya estudió. Ok. Y si encuentra uno de vocabulario o estructuras que le llame la atención, también puede verlo, siempre y cuando sea de nivel básico, no hay ningún problema. Ah, bueno, Tisha. Ok, perfecto. Eh, Muchas gracias. Ajá. Okay, y siempre recomiendo que haga cosas con vocabulario también, porque no se trata solo de gramática, sino también de ir como incrementando el, el vocabulario, ok, para, para ah, poder sí. hablar un poquito mejor. Claro que sí. Ok, Oye, perfecto. Te entonces. agradezco mucho hoy. Ok, no hay ningún problema. Bueno, Tisha. Muchas okay. gracias. Okay, good Buenas night. noches. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Yeah. Ok, um, ok, everyone. Muy bien. Um, hola a todos. Eh, solo quiero tomar ese espacio para, para hablar un poquito acerca de un tema que hemos estado estudiando esta, esta semana, ok? Así que pongamos mucha atención y espero sea útil para ustedes. Eh, and the topic is, y el tema es, um, phrasal uh, verbs. Phrasal uh, verbs, ¿ok? Phrasal, ok, hold on a second, esperen un segundo. Ok, so the topic is phrasal verbs, ¿ok? Phrasal verbs are very important in English. And let me tell you. Uh, to make a phrasal verb, uh, a phrasal verb, uh, we can make it using one verb and one preposition, okay? For example, um, imagine you want to say the verb call. So call is the verb, and then you use a preposition. The preposition is up, okay? You say call up. I am going to call up my boss, for example, okay? So this becomes a phrasal verb because you are using a preposition, okay? And then imagine you have the verb, um, Call off, for example, call is llamar. But if I put the preposition off, it has a different meaning, okay? So here, the meaning of the verb is cancel, okay? Like cancel a meeting. I am going to call off a meeting or to call off the class. Cancelar la clase, una, una reunión, okay, call off. So this becomes a phrasal verb. So in general, um, phrasal verbs, okay, uh, have the verb. So you put the verb plus one or more prepositions, okay? One or more prepositions, okay? Yeah, so this is a phrasal verb basically. And on the group, we share a list of, of phrasal verbs, okay? So you can go and check it. And in case you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask, okay? So everyone, uh, thank you very much. I wanted to give you this because this is very, very important, okay? So uh, take care. And bye-bye.